Pete went down to Alligator Ed's yesterday and picked up an old junker. So we're gonna go around here in the back and check it out. Do what? What do you see? What do you see over there? A Barbie. Oh, wonderful. <laughs> Might paint her hair red. What do you think? Yeah, sure. Look, she's got red high heels on. Can you see that? There you go. Wow, she's hanging on for dear life, looking at everybody smiling. All right, let me get this uh, backed up there, okay? 58 Etzel. Wow, it's a beauty, isn't it? Got nice beautiful white wall tires on it. That's about all I can say for it. What? He knows what he's saying. He's talking to himself. He can't even speak good English. You think he was a foreigner? How many times are you gonna bring it back and forth, back and forth? Jeez, Pete. What? Hey, you think I'd go back up that thing with chain on it? I don't care. Tires aren't flat on that. I think they're rolling. They look thick. There's one flat one, yeah. They probably won't roll very well. Back and forth. Back and forth. Does he know what he's doing? It's doubtful gonna do the old tie it to a tree and pull the trailer out from under it. We're gonna have to get a little closer to the tree. We're gonna have to get a little closer to the tree. I don't think I have a chain that's 800 feet long. Well, why didn't you get it closer to the tree, Because I didn't want to hit the bumper on the car. Jeez. We'll take the strap off. Hang on. All right. He was gonna hit the bumper, guys. Look how far away he is. Go to Louisiana and want to find a nice, beautiful, classic car. This is what you're going to get. This is Louisiana's best. This is Louisiana's best right here. A nice, beautiful old Etzel, ready to go out on the town with. Right, man? Yeah. So I even got crocheted, hand crocheted interior, Afghan style. Here we go. Huh? Is it gonna work? Or is the tree gonna win? Oh! Oh, there it goes. Oh, 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 it's gonna run into the tree! Better...
watch it, baby. Now look what I did to the front bumper. And I was going to make something out of that. The back bumper's fucked, too. Son of a bitch. I asked you if it was going to roll off. You said, no, it shouldn't roll because it has flat. Well, how did I know? Look what I did to the fucking front bumper. Fucked it up worse. And I was going to make a table out of it. That's just more money out of my pocket. Well, how are you going to get it out? That's I got to go get some more jack now. Great ideas from great thinkers don't always work out. I think the tree won, or the trailer. It's under the car. Hopefully it's not stuck under the car. We've had that happen too. Yeah. Shit. Uh, no. Uh, no. Oh, bear, watch out. Cause it's almost off. Get that ramp up, sister. You better be careful. Well, you really been a big help on this job. I can tell you that. Thank you. I appreciate it. Yeah. So what we're doing is uh, looking at it and it's looking like a pile of junk. But this just ain't a pile of junk. This is history. Did you know that, I many? History. This is history. Let me explain something to you. This Edsel. Okay, for everybody out there that doesn't know, this is a Ford Edsel. Now, the Ford Edsel was designed and built by Ford, Henry Ford's son, Edsel Ford. Okay? It's an icon of America due to the fact that this is the biggest flop car ever built in history. Did you know that, many? Ever. Okay, this has like special designs that were incorporated into the car that weren't even tested or manufactured for any, you know, for the time that it was built. And it turned out to be the biggest flop. They actually uh, had these cars sitting all over America in barns, people's barns, hidden in barns, mass productions of them, just hidden. Okay, because they were, it was like the unveiling of a special. Southwest. So uh, there you go, just another little story of traveling around America and finding the junker cars. And you know what, this car can't be restored and all the cars I have basically don't be restored, but you know what? I make art out of them, okay? I make something, if you're gonna have a trailer queen, where's that Edsel at? There it is. If you're gonna have a trailer queen, this is the kind of trailer queen to have, something that you can actually enjoy. What I'm gonna do with that, I'm gonna make a table out of it. It's gonna be a glass top table. I'm gonna put a remote system, stereo system in it with a, uh, the hidden speakers will be up in the grill. And, uh, you're gonna be really surprised. It's really gonna be unique. I'm not doing it today though. Don't fucking be looking for them real soon because it ain't gonna happen. It's not today. All right. That's what I do with my cars. Plus, I actually like keeping them out here just so I can walk out and it brings back memories. Memories of time gone by. This is Pete. I got the hiccups. Uh, I gotta go. I'll see you later. Take it easy. It's Sunday. It's hot. And uh, tomorrow's mo uh, Labor Day. Labor Day's tomorrow, and I gotta work tomorrow too. And there's a lot of other people out there, and I feel for you. That's why they call it Labor Day, because people like you and me that actually have to work on a holiday. Wow. 1958 Etzel, Southwest Ride and Custom, SWRNC.com. My friend Pete, your friend Pete, everybody's friend Pete.